Nah. No cap, boy. No rap cap. Yeah. I took the top off. Yeah. I'm dripping like hot sauce. I got drink and it's clean raw. Baby, give me that mean mouth. Hit that pussy like. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Take and React, man. And we back today with another one. Today, we're reacting to a problem I know a lot of guys deal with. This one is called Girlfriend Trusty Shoes. So, you know how it's gonna work. The video gonna play somewhere down here. And we're gonna go right into it. I think I'm going after the wrong kind of girls. You think? Fellas, you ever dated a girl that takes her finger while you're asleep to unlock your phone? She'd be creeping by your house to make sure your car's in the driveway, looking over your shoulder every time you go to text somebody? That oh, is it. so hot. You get lied to a few times, you get cheated on a few times, you start developing this really cool special power called trust issues. You turn into a superhero like Charles Xavier. And I don't understand how people just be breaking up and getting in new relationships back to back to back. I don't trust nobody. I don't give a flux capacitor. Watch your profanity. My trust issues are so bad at this point, I don't even trust what my girlfriend trusts me. Hit my girlfriend up like, hey, uh, Claudia just came over. She said she wanna go to the gym and then negate the whole workout by going to get some ice cream. Do you, boo-boo? I'll just talk to you tomorrow then. Talk to me tomorrow? Ain't nobody said this was gonna be overnight. Uh, Claudia, I can't go to the gym. Uh, no, 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 where are you at? Who you, no, 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 who you with? Another reason I have trust issues is I know how many of my friends have cheated on their boyfriend or girlfriends and they're taking it to the grave. I took a break from ships, as in relationships, because I could, everybody, you can't trust nobody. I break up with my last girlfriend and one of my friends, Billie Jean, me and Billie Jean start hanging out. We eventually hook up. And by hook up, I mean above the neck kissing and below the neck kissing. I don't need to get Pacific. You get the idea. We hang out again, we hook up again. Then she's like, listen, I know you just got out of a relationship. You're not trying to date anybody. I don't even be hooking up with anybody if I'm not in a relationship with them, but you kind of cute, so I'll make an exception. If this is gonna continue, I'm the only one. I can only hook up with you and I cannot hook up with anybody else. That sound like a relationship to me. But okay. Yeah. It's whatever's. So me and Billie Jean start hanging out once a week, then twice a week. Then this turns into a Monday, Wednesday, Friday thing. I know this goes on for a few months, okay? And it's great because when I'm lonely, she's there. When she's lonely, I just ignore her. But then one night, she comes over. She falls asleep. I'm out in the kitchen. I see her phone. I go to plug it in so it's charging while she sleeps. She's a text from who, who is king? Now I know her password. But I can't unlock her phone and look at this text because when she wakes up, she's gonna know that I looked at it. It's real hard to out ninja me. I was raised by ninjas. Scorpion, Jago, Leonardo. Dems is my dudes. I feel myself getting worked up and I'm like, you know what, no, 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 no. You're not even dating this girl. So you can't even get mad. You can't, ew. What the fuck? Oh, a side note, why is this dude texting you at one o'clock in the morning? Some dude I don't even connote. But King could just be an old friend, and I'm just tripping. Friday comes along. She comes over, she falls asleep, her phone's out in the kitchen. I go to plug it in. <laughs> King, now it's texting you way past booty call o'clock. And you got your preview text off? Future girlfriend, if you're watching, just know that if I ever ask you about a dude, we're playing chess. Because I either know the answer and I'm about to see if you're gonna lie to me, or I'm about to gauge your reaction. I wait. Facts. Facts, I do that so much, I ain't even gonna care. I already know the answer for A. Two weeks before I say anything to her, we're out having lunch, and I go, um, who's king? Oh, oh whoa, whoa, how? That's how Sophie. You know, how, how do you know what that is? You know you done messed up already, right? You tell me who he is, I'll tell you how I know about him. Uh, uh, I met him at an audition. He keeps trying to take me on a date. I, don't, I will not go on a date with him. If you want to catch somebody, give them a false sense of security. Scorpion taught me that. 
fast forward four or five more weeks. Me and Billie Jean are riding around. She's playing music on YouTube through her aux cable on her phone. She pulls up oh. to a Starbucks, runs inside, and as soon as she's gone, I pull out my phone, go to video, hit record, take her phone, go to her text. King is the third to last person that you last messaged. And I get to the top, and then I swipe down. Swipe, 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 swipe. Ninja mode. All up in this <laughs> Cuz a detective. He going through that bitch. Each. Watch your profanity. Put my phone back in my pocket, put her phone back on YouTube, and I'm just blasting the music and singing along. I knew you were trouble when you were dead. Boy, if you don't We get back to my place, she goes in and takes a shower, I pull out my phone. I get that video, I hit play. You're not gonna out ninja me. The first few texts, hey, it's Billie Jean from the audition. What's up, save me as king. What are you doing tonight? You should come over. Okay. Ew. The next day, they start talking back and forth about how awesome the hookup was. You met this dude and hooked up with him on the first night? Word. There's evidence of more than one hookup in this text conversation, okay? Mind you, I just got back from a seven day cruise, so I haven't seen Billie Jean in over a week. Billie Jean gets out the shower, jumps on the bed, she starts getting a little frisky, and I pull back and notice, wait, are those bruises? Um, <laughs> you know, I was babysitting, you know, I babysit my boss's kids sometimes, and, you know, just kids just get rough sometimes. At that point, Damn. I shut it down. I'm like, okay, emergency meeting. Let's talk about King. Remember, if I'm asking you questions, uh -oh, really don't answer. I'm guessing he's the one that did these bruises. True or false? I told you, it was the kids. It was the kids. Little kids at all this? I don't buy it. Try again. It took about 30 minutes of whatever she was doing before she finally came completely clean. Yeah, after that. Me and Billie Jean didn't talk for like five plus months. GG, no re. So for you girls who be tweeting me and DMing me on some, Swoozy, how are you single? I can't find anybody trustworthy enough to date. Can't find anybody trustworthy enough to friends with Benny's. <sighs> so hard out here for a ninja pimp. That messed up. And she told him to not miss no girl. I feel like I've been in that situation before. Well, I know I heard of somebody being in that situation before. But thanks for watching. That's the video, man. Come back, watch the next one, because I'm coming hard. And if you haven't watched my other videos on him, go back and watch them. They're pretty funny, too. Thanks for watching them. I'll take on react. Peace. Uh, and I know these fuck niggas against me. You were here when I was down, now you going no winning. She just hurt me to my soap, I thought you wasn't with me. For these niggas out to get me, I told that stenching. I was down bad on my dick, then you left in my feelings. Ain't no way that my heart broke, there's no way you can hit.